see how to do the regression by using the SPSS statistic. Okay, so on the top of the menu, uh, click Analyze, uh, choose Regression, and then select Linear. Okay, so this will open up the Linear Regression dialog box. Okay, so here we have uh, two box here, the Dependent and Independent. Okay, so we're going to move uh, the independent variable in the independent box and the dependent variable in the dependent box. Okay, so you can uh, select or uh, choose the variable by either drag or drop or use uh, the arrow button here. Okay, so in this case, uh, the temple behemoth will be the independent and maka penilaian uh, will be the dependent. Okay, so leave the rest as a default and just click OK. Right, so this will generate the result of the SPSS statistic. Okay, so if you see here, okay, there's a quite a few table in the output for the linear regression. Okay, so in this section, I will show you uh, only uh, two main table, okay, which is the model summary and the coefficient. Okay, so we're going to see one by one. Okay, so the first table here, uh, we have the model summary table. Okay, so this table uh, will provide uh, the correlation coefficient and also the coefficient of determination, okay, the R square. Okay, so as we have already seen, uh, a coefficient of 0 0.690 suggests that there is a moderate uh, positive relationship okay, between the tempo berhemat and markah penilaian. Okay, so while the R square here, okay, 0 0.476, suggests that 47.6% of the variance in markah penilaian can be explained by the tempo berhemat. Okay, uh, in other words, we can say that the score of the marker penilaian is strongly predicted by the score of tempo berhemat. Okay, so next we're going to see the, the coefficient table. Okay, so this table uh, will provide us with the necessary information to predict a marker penilaian from tempo berhemat uh, as well as uh, determine whether tempo berhemat uh, contributes statistically uh, significant to the model okay by looking at the significant uh, column here okay so from here we can see that uh, the value of the significant is uh, less than 0 0.05 okay so it means that uh, it is uh, statistically significant okay so now let's see uh, the value here okay so basically in the constant row here so the B value uh, provide us with uh, the intercept value. Okay, so this is the intercept value, our A. Okay, and in the tempo berhemat row, okay, uh, the B column here provides the gradient of the regression equation. Okay, so this means that for every one uh, standard mark increase uh, in tempo berhemat the model predict uh, an increase of 0 0.061 standard marks in a uh, markah penilaian. Okay, so the equation will be markah penilaian equal to 2.629, okay, this is the intercept, plus 0 0.061, okay, this is the gradient times with the tempo perhimat. 